Okay, in this presentation, this is going to be a short one. Essentially, what we're going to do here is we're going to have a look at hyperbolic functions, and it's just a simple proof. Uh, we have two hyperbolic functions. Uh, the hyperbolic sine, which I'm going to pronounce as shine, okay, and hyperbolic cosine, which I am going to pronounce as cosh, okay. So, just for the sake of simplicity, shine and cosh. Okay, it's, I'm not I'm not happy about those pronunciations, but uh, it's it, it's less uh, of a tongue twister than hyperbolic sine and hyperbolic cosine. So anyway, here we have shine squared of x. Okay, so essentially shine x to be all to be squared equal to a half of cosh two x minus one. So just remember uh, that minus one is in the brackets. Okay. So essentially what we have to show is that this side is equal to this side, okay? So it's a very straightforward uh, enough operation, okay? What I'm going to do here is start with the left-hand side. And this is the, when we use the exponential function, this is what uh, shine is, e to the x minus e to the minus 2x, or minus x over 2, okay? Just like that. And we square it, okay? Because it's shine of x all to be squared. So we're just going to square that. So essentially, this is a, 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 a just be careful with this. Um, so e to the x times e to the x is e to the two x. Okay. So in both cases, now we have e to the x times e to the minus x, e to the x times e to the minus x, and e to the x times e to the minus x. And then we have e to the minus e to the minus x times minus e to the minus x, and that works out as plus e to the minus 2x. Essentially, just watch the sign there, basically, okay? And also remember that e to the x uh, squared is e to the 2x, and e to the minus x squared is e to the minus 2x, okay? So, e to the x times e to the minus x is, essentially what you do is add the two powers there. So, x plus minus x it just gives us zero, so we end up with e to the zero. Likewise, we do uh, do so here, okay? So e to the zero is actually simply just one. So just sort of piecing that together, e to the two x plus e to the minus two x minus two over four. Now that's where I'm gonna stop, okay? And now I am going to go to the right-hand side, okay? So I'm gonna work on this now, okay? And let's just start it up there. Okay, so we start off with minus a half of cosh uh, 2x minus 1, okay? So cosh of 2x is, well, cosh of x is e to the x plus e to the minus x over 2. So we, rather than x here, we have 2x. So we have e to the 2x plus e to the minus 2x over 2, okay? Uh, we have minus 1 there. So what I'm going to do is just put that, uh, re-express that 1 as minus 2 over 2, common denominator. So we can actually go from this here to this down here, okay? Uh, we have the half outside, okay? So we just remember that. And essentially, it actually resolves pretty quickly such that we get an expression that is identical. So the left-hand side is equal to the right-hand side, okay? So that's essentially the proof done, okay? So we'll leave the video there. This is a nice and short one. 